She had Alzheimer's and dementia. She always used to say she got two for the price of one. Uh, yeah, and I this think is, people... This is her here. Yeah. It? Look at me mum. I remember when she had that hair done, when she, she came home, uh, the first time she came home, I was like, take it off again, take it off. I thought it was a wig. Um, but uh, yeah, I mean, Alzheimer's is cruel because I think people think it's just about memories, but you actually forget how to swallow. Yeah. By the it's end. not just about, you know, forgetting who people are. It's about so much more than that. And we need to do so much more to mm. raise awareness, to raise funds uh, on many levels, because it is a brutal disease. And one in three of us, it's soon to be one in two of us, is going to experience it. Yeah, because we're living longer. In the Middle Ages, we didn't, I yeah. guess we didn't have hardly any of it, did we? At all. But, but I, I know what you went through. You lost three stone in weight or something, did you? Went, yeah, really, got really thinned out when your mum was unwell. I'm a mummy's boy and I am proud yeah. of that. I lost my dad when I was 17 and at that time, and I guess I didn't really, I didn't understand it then. I didn't understand what sort of, what death meant because I didn't have to go through it in the same way. With my mum, I was there right to the end. Uh, I, we looked after her for four years at home. Um, Watching the life leave somebody, it just is a profound thing and it had a profound effect on me. I, one that I'm grateful for though, because you know, she gave me a gift. It was her parting gift for me to sort myself out.